Welcome to this Windows channel and this is the quick look and review of the latest build of Windows 10 which is build 15031 and this build was released today February the 8th around 1 p.m. Eastern Time and uh, this is of course one of the latest builds for Creators Update on Windows 10 and uh, of course it's a build that's light on features but it still has a few new features a lot of people thought there would not be any new features everything should be locked down well it's not as you see but we're probably very close to that as we're getting closer and closer to the insider preview builds um, basically what happens is that this build downloads of course uh, through Windows Update one thing that I gotta say it's actually much faster to install or much well at least it's faster to install than pretty much um, the last builds and um, I, I was kinda surprised at how fast it actually installed on my PC so I was wondering am I alone but some other insiders are actually saying that this is a faster install than the previous installs so kind of interesting to see uh, of course <coughs> a few bugs that I gotta talk about that will help any insider want that that wants to upgrade first. I had um, two bug, two different bugs on two different machines. So I've got two insider machines: one the home version, one's the pro version. So on this machine that you're watching right now, I had the impression that the download was kind of blocked at a certain percentage, and I did not uh, basically really. Um, you know, I thought it was stuck and there's nothing happening. So what happened is I decided to, you know, pull out of the settings app and then go back and watch and you know what, it wasn't stuck. So what I'm seeing here is that when you download this update, if you see that you're stuck at zero or I, you know, any number, mine was stuck at 38%. Just get out of the settings app. Don't shut down your computer. Just get out of the settings app and go back into your Windows updates and you'll see that the progression is actually moving. It's just that it doesn't update from time to time. And it's a known bug, by the way. Also, initialization, that takes a long time. Uh, for some people, it happens. And finally, a third bug that actually plagued my other machine. If you see that nothing seems to be happening in the Windows update stuff, right-click, uh, don't right-click, go into your Cortana and in Cortana type services here you'll want to actually start the services uh, app to actually go to Windows Update and where you're in Windows Update right click on it click stop go into your start button go into your power button click restart to restart your PC and after that you should actually be back in business. Just go to Windows Update. It should see the build 15031 available uh, in your downloads. And uh, like I say, if you get stuck at a percentage of download, do not worry about it. You will have a download. It's still downloading. Uh, if you move out of the settings app and go back and go back into Windows Update, it you'll see that it actually changed. So um, this is. Um, really a bug, a known bug in the updates. So what's new in features in here? What's new in features? Um, not a lot but a few little things and one actually two that I find kinda cool. One is the compact overlay window. What's that? You know, you sometimes are watching a movie, watching something and you wanna switch app, wanna watch your email, you wanna open a Word document, I don't know and suddenly you find yourself that you know that famous little window where you're watching something is in the background and of course you're not seeing anything well the compact overlay window what it does is actually it will simply take the video that's playing and put it in a little corner for you to continue viewing so it looks like this you have a video playing 
and you open apps like here, OneNote, and um, you know, um, uh, here is uh, Excel. And look at the video. The video is still here on the upper right corner. It's still playing a little bit like an iPad. If you have an iPad, you'll notice that if you move around, for example, the video window, you will, of course, have that little um, window still playing at the bottom of your iPad, for example, and while you're doing something else. So you know, it's one. Of, I think it's a cool feature. It's something that's nice. Uh, watching a Netflix movie, for example. So it will work with all sorts of apps, including mu movies and TV, Skype preview, uh, Netflix, and more apps to come. So that's pretty uh, cool, and I think it's a nice add to uh, Windows 10. One other thing that's interesting is something here. It's called Dynamic Lock. So this has been added. What's Dynamic Lock? Dynamic Lock is a feature where if your phone is paired with your computer of over Bluetooth, that means your computer can track you and know that you're around in this um, vicinity of the PC. And when you move away and the computer loses its Bluetooth pairing with your phone, after 30 seconds, screen the PC, the windows will turn off the screen and lock the PC down. So this is good if you you know forgot your PC uh, turned on and you're doing something and then you decide to go away and there's other people in the room, you know that your PC after 30 seconds will actually lock down by itself. So a nice little feature. We'll try to test it. I don't know if I'll be able, but we'll try to test it. Uh, and this will be done, of course, on the Insiders channel. Here is the review. But on the Insiders channel, we'll have not only a review, but we have tons of features that we will, of course, be talking about uh, as we're getting more and more into the Insiders channel. Also, we will talk about this build in the next Windows Insider Hour next Tuesday, 6 p.m. Eastern, uh, 2300 hours UTC. So uh, that's also on the Insiders channel. If you're wondering where that is, it, the link to it will be in the description below this video. What else? Do we have apart from that uh, game mode is expanded from um, basically more games and the list of games is of course on the Microsoft website so lots and lots of games uh, by the way and um, you know they're going to expand it so that the game bar Windows game bar works full screen for pretty much every um, every the most, the most, the biggest number of games possible, and um, don't forget. First, one little thing: talking about the Bluetooth pairing and the feature that we just talked about, dynamic lock. There's a bug that prevents some devices from actually connecting through Bluetooth on this build. So, if you want to try it, it might not work for you. And last but not least, don't forget that we are in the bash the windows 10 bug bash for february there is in the facebook the facebook <laughs> feedback hub quests on the left side look at all these quests these are all the little things they want you to do and try to help and improve your windows operating system uh, by testing that out with quests and trying to find different bugs so don't worry about it uh, try it out. It's you know nice to have these little quests there to uh, try to improve Windows if possible. You can give your comments, your feedback, also about anything that's wrong, anything that is not working. Now there's a big list of fixes and of bad problems in here, and so um, I will keep that for the Insider Channel. There's a lot of little things that are actually broken. Uh, including the ones that I talked about on the um, the install issues. So try it out. And remember one thing, if you are stuck at a previous build farther than 15025, remember that the image files, the ISOs of 15025 have been put online for both 64 and 32 bits. So Check it out. On this machine, I had a glitch that prevented me from going to uh, 15.0.25. So what I did, I used the image files. I clean installed yesterday. 
and I upgraded today to 15031. That helped me move on to a, a more recent build. So, uh, of course, much more on the Insiders channel where there's going to be a lot of stuff where we're going to talk about the uh, Insider previews and, uh, of course, our live new live show every Tuesdays uh, on, this, uh, on the other channel, which is pretty cool. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. If you have any comments, questions, suggestions, let us know. And uh, thank you so much for following us on this channel.